Good afternoon and welcome to Williams Dog Training Company. We're here today with Fred and Margo, and what we're going to be demonstrating for you today is Margo's ability to understand and respond to her obedience commands, the corrections and motivations that we give her while we're working with her, and the training equipment that we're using. Fred is using a regular six foot web training leash, and he keeps the bulk of that leash folded neatly in his right hand, leaving his left hand free to give the correction. The correction that we give is a tug and let go on the training collar, which is the second piece of equipment that we're using. Margo has been fitted with her own personal training collar and will show you how to properly use this during your one-on-one -on -one lesson. As you can see, Margo is seated very nicely on Fred's left, which is where all our obedience training is done. The first exercise they're going to demonstrate is healing. Healing is proper walking on a leash. Fred and Margo are going to take off doing that now. The command is Margo heal. We've also incorporated into this an automatic sit. Anytime Fred stops his feet, Margo will sit. There's one right there. It's important during the healing process that Margo walks at your pace on your left hand side. She should not pull ahead or lag behind. And there's another automatic sit there. And another automatic set. The next exercise we're going to demonstrate is the stay command. The stay is a hand and voice command. Fred's going to use the open flat of his left palm about an inch or so from Margo's muzzle and the one word command to stay. Okay. He'll then walk out to the end of the training leash. Margo should remain seated throughout the entire exercise. This is a great exercise to practice at home. You can start at about a minute and build your way up to three minutes to help build up Margo's self-control. When Fred returns back to Margo, he's going to walk all the way around her, providing an added distraction as he goes behind her, and right back into heel position on the left-hand side. She remains seated throughout, gets a little praise, and they're off healing again. Excellent job. We're going to demonstrate some more of the heel, the sit, and the stay for you. And gives her the stay and out to the end of the training leash. And this time, instead of returning back to Margo, Fred's going to demonstrate the recall or the come command. Margo. Call Margo in using her name Hi. in a nice voice. She comes in, sits very nicely right in front, and then we have an exercise called the finish. Margo will heel around the back of Fred and right back into left hand side heel position, seated nicely. Stay. Demonstrate it one more time. Leave her in the sit and the stay and out to the end of the training leash. Call her in using her name. She's going to come in, sit in front, and then she'll heel around the back, right back to the left hand side heel position. Very nicely done. And they're off healing again. It's a good time to remind you you should be practicing all of your commands, both inside and outside your home, and incorporating them into your daily life. About 15 to 20 minutes a day, just to keep all the commands fresh in Margaret's mind. We're going to demonstrate our down commands. The first one is down from the heel position. Fred's going to use the open flat of his left palm straight down towards the ground and the one word firm command to down. He'll then give her a stay and that's the end of the training leash. She's going to remain down throughout the entire exercise. It's another great exercise to help build that self-control. You can start at about three minutes and work your way up to about five. As Fred returns back to Margo, he's going to walk all the way around her as he did on the sit stay and right back into heel position on the left hand side. She remains down throughout and he gives her the heel command and they're off healing again. We're going to demonstrate that one more time for you. Gives her the down and the stay. And out to the end of the training leash again. And this time he's going to demonstrate that recall or the come command. Calls her in. And she comes in very nicely and sits right in front. And then she'll heel around the back and right back to left hand side heel position. Very 
very good. And they're off healing. We'll give them a second to get lined up for our final command, which will be down from a distance. And this will be the down from a distance. You're going to leave Margo in a sit stay and walk out to the end of the training leash. And this will be the only time you're going to use your right hand to give the command. And Fred will drop Margo into the down from the end of the training leash. Perfect. He'll then return back to her once again by walking all the way around and back into heel position. Very nice job. All right, we've demonstrated for you the obedience commands that Margo has learned here at school. It's been a pleasure working with Margo, and thank you again for choosing Williams Dog Training Company as your personal dog trainer.